All right. And here we go. Owen Bell. Music by Chris Zabriskie. The Alfred Free Sloan Foundation. Special thanks to these fuckers. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Okay, so like I said, I didn't have a chance to test this out or anything. Mission Gather Grow Experiment. Okay. Pick flower. Name species. Dumbass flower. Got a lot of dumbass flowers around here. Can I pick up multiple of them? Yes. Yes, I can. Sixty-three percent genetically similar to dumbass flower. Other dumbass flower. Dumbass reed, I guess. I'm assuming we get a lab somewhere where we can, like. Oh, we got some music all of a sudden. Guess might as well take two specimens. See that mountain? You can climb. Oh, nope, you can't. No, you can't. Absolutely not. Fuck you, Todd Howard. Oh, this mountain we can climb, apparently. Okay, let's plant dumbass flower on the mountain. Ah, okay. I see. I'm not going to take a screenshot, but thank you. The other hand appears to be rather superfluous at this point. Uzurum is climbing a mountain and hoping that something happens. Okay, so it's... Parents, dumbass flower, another dumbass flower. Baby dumbass. So is this all just plants that I've got here? What else is there? Oh shit, there's fucking those trees from the fucking Lorax are over here. Okay. Like fuck I do, Char. You could. You don't. Have, you don't have to boss me. No, really. This is the, this is the fucking trees from the Lorax, right? I can't remember what they're called. That's a flower. It's a big ass flower. Oh, you big ass flower. There we go. Apparently, it's not a tree; it's flower. So I don't, I don't know what. Let's get a green one. Truffles. That's the way. That's the one. Thank you, stealing carbon. I was. Oh God! What a dumbass broccoli over here? What the hell? It was like one of them paper umbrellas you get in a goddamn uh, dumbass dubamass. Oh, 
Umbrellas. <laughs> Alright, so we've got all these species now. Let's... Wait, what? Okay, I thought it said new species somewhere. In oh, this is... So this is a different species. To a big-ass flower, apparently. This yellow one, I guess, is distinct enough... To be different from big ass flower. The island's covered in the big ass flowers. I, I, I'm going to experiment with the big ass flowers, I think. I think those are the sort of thing that I'm looking to. So let's let's see what we get when we when we mix the big ass flower. With the broccoli fucker. Do we just get a big ass broccoli? This is advanced biology here, folks. Oh, there she go. Oh, there she go. Oh, she's thick. Oh, this is a thick boy. Why he's so thick, though? All right, we're... we need to see what the what the plumage is. Oh, it's got oh wow, it's got the multicolored. Nice. We've got us a big ass umbrella. <laughs> yeah. Now I wonder. Oh. Oh, hello. We got a neon tree over here. Hold on. Let me, let me plant down a little bit of I'm going to I'm going to put the put the big ass umbrella guy over here. Here with it's another big ass flower to see if we can get even more big ass flowers. We're going to name you Neon Ass Tree. Do I need to, do I really need to name it? Okay, fine. Big ass umbrella. Oh, this one's splitting a lot more. Oh, she got so few, so many fewer colors than her mom did. Yeah, it just looks like another big ass flower. Well, that simply won't do. That won't do. Boring ass umbrella. Yeah, this one's boring ass flower right here. This. Let's pick a flower from the neon ass tree and see what. I wonder what would happen if we took our, our old friend here, the big ass umbrella, and we mixed it with the neon ass tree. Yeah, this is like a wander around, name stuff, and breed plants simulator. I wonder if there's any life on this island. Let's 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 go off and search. Any animal life, I mean. We found the flora. Can we find the fauna? Oh, this is a different neon ass boy. Look at this boy. Very genetically similar to the big ass flower, apparently. I don't know how, but it doesn't look anywhere near the same. But I like, I like it. Let's mix the two neon boys together. Let's see what we can. Waiting, I can name this guy right here. Neon ass, the purple flower. Okay, it's red like it's dad. All right. See some brambles over there. Some bramble bushes. Proteus with a gimmick. 
We're creating life, okay? This is important stuff. Yeah, I don't know what's going on in the sky there. It's fucked up. I don't know what world we've descended on onto, but it's not... It's fucked up. Something's fucked up. It might be me. <laughs> Maybe I'm fucked. Take your time, okay? Yeah, just fucking... It's growing tall and strong, but like, come on, man. Cloudy with a chance. The triangles are pointing to a, to a specific vantage point, it looks like. I'm very unsettled. Okay. Oh, interesting. It's got, uh... It's got green leaves. Neon-ass neon leafy boy. Leon-ass. Fucking Leon-ass leafy... What are these brambles over here? I don't... Bramble boy. They should have a categorical meaning. I'm not- I'm not a scientist, okay? Like, I can't... I can't give real, true definitions to these things. A lot of Bramble Boys over here on the shore. Let's try the other side of the island, see what we can find. These things look like they're related to the... The other dumbass flowers. Oh, these are just the other dumbass flowers, okay. We've just found a field of the other dumbass flowers. Kinda lame, IMO. This should be... Is this really it? Is this the whole island? I feel like I haven't gone behind that mountain yet. Let's try the, the orange peaks. It's just asses and boys. <laughs> That's the two genders. <laughs> Let me grab another one of my friend's big ass flower here. Okay. Okay, so over there, what the fuck is that? The fuck are you? Shrimpy boy. Okay, it's more, it's more like umbrella fuckers, but yeah. It's a shrimpy boy. Gotta plant some stuff here. Let's just combine a few more of the, uh... A few more of the, uh, the originals, the OGs, the baby dumbass and the original dumbass. Can you swim? I got into that pond earlier, but I don't think it'll let me go too far offshore. I'm guessing. Yeah, it stopped me. <laughs> it definitely did not want me going too far offshore. Okay, let me get, let me get my shrink, shrimpy boy. The time for dumbass flowers is over. The time for the time for the boys is now. Is that it? Are you is that all? That's some That's some triple dumbass action right there. That's now Let's try something real fun here. Let's let's take our boy the big ass umbrella. And this guy's an umbrella. The shrimpy boy is an umbrella. So let's see what we got. We can buy yeah, as a sad boy. I'm a sad boy. <laughs> oh, we got a little triangle here. Okay. It's growing. It's growing taller than your average shrimpy boy, so that's good. We're getting. We're getting his dad's genes in there. 
This is, I believe, supposed to be an educational game on how genetics work or some shit, but I, I don't know. Yeah, it's just... <laughs> I hope this isn't being kept in a database somewhere. <laughs> Can you imagine some fucking research student opens the thing and like, The fuck is the dumbass flower, but dumbass umbrella? What the fuck? Oh, is that it? Oh, it's it's got such tiny leaves. So sad. I can't appear to go up the mountain, so that's great. This drone's awesome. Whatever the hell I'm piloting. See if I can make a massive shrimpy boy. Yeah, let's go back down here. I just wanted to get some big ass flowers because those are my favorite of the bunch thus far. Oh, okay, you can't. Okay, there's a boost. There's a boost. Okay. Didn't even th didn't even try that. Didn't even think about that. Let's see if there's anything else behind the island here first, or in this little alcove. Any big, any good hidden boys around the island? I don't see any. Let's get a shrimpy boy here. Yo, this is like a pink shrimpy boy. Anything over here? Can we head over to this part of the island? I'm looking for like hidden plants. Okay, let's uh, let's mix up our our big ass flower with our shrimpy boy and try to make a big old shrimpy boy. And I kept it orange just so that hopefully it just ends up being a big old shrimpy boy. That's also possible. I was thinking about that, but I haven't seen that because I I grew two of like the dumbass flower babies in different spots. One on the mountain and one on the sand, and they both look the same. But you know what? That is what that is what the scientific goddamn method is for. I wish there was a boost button to make you run faster. Well, no, no, sure. We're gonna do we're gonna do some science. We're gonna do some science here. I'm all about that science. So let's see another shrimpy boy. We're gonna do a similar experiment. We're gonna plant a dumb at, We're gonna plant a big ass flower and a shrimpy boy. In a different biome, as it were. I wish we were alive. Had a run button. Fucking say, okay. Okay, so this is our this is our new this is our new friend right here. This is the parents are a big ass flower and a shrimpy boy. So the next the next experiment will be to plant it with the shrimpy boy as the pedigree in Dragon Warrior Monsters terms, and the big ass flower as the secondary parent, and see if it creates a different thing. Also, I'm gonna get rid of some of the other stuff in my inventory because I don't need. I don't need the dumbass flower and the bramble boy. We're doing science, and then I'm gonna do the same two combinations on the sand, or on the mountain. One of the other. One of the. What is one of the other like types of land, and see what we get. We're doing real science here, folks. This is saving. Why are you saving? Thankfully, the big ass flowers aren't too far away from here. Yeah, please do not quit game. 
Did we make a fun game? I am enjoying this. I don't... I like biology a lot, so this is great. Okay, so let's... Pick another couple of big-ass flowers. The color shouldn't matter in theory. I guess I'll grab two orange ones. I guess I'll grab some orange ones just in case. Just so that I guess the results are... Oh, I grabbed a green one accidentally. Whatever. Is that the same flower? Yeah, it's a big-ass flower. They're all big-ass flowers. The, the babies should be the same. The only, di the only difference should be color. The overall shape and type of the plant should be the same, except for the color. Look, the big ass flowers are the best parts. Okay, so let's let's first of all let's take a look at our 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 our, our favorite children over here. Alrighty, you can see a little difference in how the how the leaves are spread. It's not much of a difference. But the shrimp, uh, kind of counterintuitively, the shrimpy boy grew taller, it looks like, than the, the one who just had the big ass flower as the, maybe I need to rename these species. Also, there didn't seem to be a difference in color. Like, the orange appears to be the, the dominant gene here. The shrimpy boy seems to be taking precedence with its orange umbrellas over the big ass flower. So yeah, you can see here, full tree, slightly taller, when the shrimpy boy was the thing. I gotta call you, not shrimpy boy. And you, my friend, are tragically still moderately shrimpy boy. In comparison to your brother. So apparently there are differences. Depending on who the quote unquote pedigree parent is. I don't think you can plant in the ocean. Let's see. Oh, oh, okay, you can. So you know what, we're gonna do that. So first let's do big ass flowers of pedigree. And Trivia Boy is the pedigree. There we go. And it seems to be growing... It is a more vibrant red. Which is weird, because the flower was orange. So it, it, it might just be, I don't think the biome's affecting it where you plant them. I'm thinking that the big difference maker here is, uh... oh, well, this guy's completely different. Look at this. This is just like a big ass flower split off into two things. All right, so we got four things. I'm going to guess here. I'm gonna guess here that the offspring to the same two plants is always going to be a little bit slightly different and a new spe and count as a new species. No matter where you plant them. The only way we can find that out though is by trying to replant these two guys. Wanna inbreed the shrimpy boys. Yeah, we haven't tried I guess we haven't tried inbreeding before, so. We can try and inbreed the shrimpy boys. Uh, 
I don't know, I'm guessing that there's just, you know, as is, this isn't how species actually work, but like, there is always going to be some variance, that's how evolution works, that there's some variance, okay, so Shrimpy Boy and Shrimpy Boy, will they make another Shrimpy Boy or will it be another new species, because it shouldn't be another new species. Going by the actual laws of biology, but <laughs> who fucking cares about that? Science! Alright, it's looking like a shrimpy boy. It's looking like a shrimpy boy. It's a shrimpy boy, okay. So it, yes. So we have created another shrimpy boy here. So I'm going to, I've got two more experiments I, I want to run here. And then we'll be done with this game. Oh, what did, what did you mean, Char? Did you mean all the... Because if you mean all the shrimpy boys on the island over there, I'm going to do that too. That is our next... That is our next step. Okay. So I'm going to... Oh, God. Oh, Jesus Christ. Come on. Calm down, boy. Calm down. Calm down, my friend. Okay, so... I'm going to grab two more dumbass flowers. Yes. Yes. Sure. That is... That is my next, that is my next step, is... I'm going to create six of the... Six of the big-ass flower shrimpy boy combos. All in different biome areas, because I'm going to plant these ones on the sand. See if there's any, like, noticeable changes between them all. I don't think there will be, but... You know what? That's why we do science! The reason why we do science is to... Uh... I don't know. <laughs> so this time on the sand. Big ass flower and shrimpy boy. I guess I should probably have the chat on because, you know. There we go. Chat's on screen now. So, the... And then over here, we're going to plant ourselves a shrimpy boy parent with a big ass flower parent. Yeah, that I mean, that's how science works. You do science so that you can learn how to do even more science. So right now the hypothesis is that there is no actual difference based on biome of what you're growing. That's the current hypothesis. <laughs> well, what kind of doctor are you, Dr. Smasher? <laughs> uh. Uzwer, PhD in Mendel. Yeah. Okay, so. Again. The best I can tell in terms of differences is that the ones whose parents are the Shrimpy Boy, whose main parent, rather, is the Shrimpy Boy, seem to have much more divergence in because it's this one yep and then this one right no it says yeah this one so not always so in two out of three of them the one with the split in the stem was the shrimpy boy is the parent and this one was not so, 
I'm guessing this game might just be bullshit and there's no actual difference. But now it's time for the real hard rock. Where we're gonna start... We're gonna start doing so You know, I have this random flower in my inventory. I need to get rid of it. I would never go to the University of Utah. I mean, it's, I mean, genetics has a little bit of randomness thrown in, so that's, it would make sense. I'm gonna breed this thing with a shrimpy boy real quick, just cause. My inventory's full, and I don't need that in my life. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna label these. We're gonna label these. Is that how you spell specimen? I feel like that's not how you spell specimen. Specimen, okay. So specimen boy one. I was like, I knew that was wrong. Specimen boy two. Okay, so I have to rename these. <laughs> Specimen Boy 3. Specimen Boy 4. Specimen Boy 5. And of course, Dave. Okay, and so we've got the we've got our six plants. They've got their they've got their specimen names. We're all set and ready to go. So I'm just gonna grab one leaf from each one of them. And we're gonna do some we're gonna do some breeding among the breeding. That really confused me when I looked at that and it said specimen boy two number one. Jesus Christ. Alright, so I think I think that we can I think that we can safely because, I mean, obviously in real scientific rigor, this would require a lot more experimentation, but, like, I think that at this point in time, we can rule out the idea that where, where you plant them changes them. Maybe? Let me see the flowers from these, because the two flowers from the sand one were similar, and the two flowers from those two were similar. So let's see, I guess. Oh, my, oh man, my thesis is going to be on this, you know. That's... And Dave. Alright. There we go. Okay, so. Let's go over to the other side of the island here where we can do a little experimentation. Oh, these guys are over here. Is this a species we missed? I think it is. Ah. 69% similar to specimen number five. Well, goddamn, how could I refuse? Okay, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. All right, so. We're gonna crossbreed between biomes. We're gonna breed specimen one. Specimen three. Specimen four with Dave. And of 
course, specimen two is specimen five. Just so we're making sure that they're all being crossbred among each other. Dave has all the dominant genes. That's that's right. Dave knows what the fuck he's Dave knows what the fuck he's about. I'm just gonna name all these guys Dave, actually. Alright. Interesting. Oh! We got some green boys! Look at that! Oh, look at that! My god! Oh, look at- yeah, no, look at that! Dave, with all the dominant genes in this fucking family. Well, I mean, this guy, okay, it's gotta be. Dave Jr. Oh, apparently this is, apparently, in terms of actual, because it was saying that it was still specimen boy number five, but it was saying it was Dave with green hair. All right, so since Dave is our pride and joy here, I'm not even going to name these guys. Fuck these guys. No one cares about them. We just need to make the best Dave that we can make. We just need... Like, Dave needs to be the dominant species on this fucking island. I think. So what we're going to do here... Is we're going to cross-plant... Dave with those other two and make like the master Dave if you're catching my drift here like it's gonna be the the ultimate Dave and then once we get these two then we can breed them into the best Dave big Dave the greatest of Daves that you've ever seen That is interesting that this one had green hair, though. That's <laughs> Alright, so it's gone back to the orange on this one. Oh, really? So. So, 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 so. I'm thinking, actually... That the dominant genes come from the second parent you pick, not the first. It's the opposite of Dragon Warrior Monsters. Because both of these are more genetically similar to the specimen than to Dave. This requires further experimentation. This is for science, folks. I can't, ju I can't just not... I can't just eschew the scientific method here. Is this thing out of... Okay, I was gonna say, it's not out of goddamn leaves. I see some. But again, there's only one way to find out, Shark. So let's... This time we'll make Dave the secondary parent of these guys. And we'll see if they come out more Davey. More Dave-esque. Well, already we can see some differences here. All right, genetically similar to Dave. There we go. That see, that's what I like to see. Okay, apparently the green was just a single. Apparently the green was just a single. 
a single thing. Uh, so let's take the strongest of these. These two. I'm gonna take these two because they're the closest to original Dave. I'm gonna plant them, I'm gonna get their flower, and then I'm gonna crossbreed them with original Dave. Dave Classic. So these are the two Daves that we just got. The sons of the sons of the sons of Dave. I'm gonna get a flower from original Dave. The true father of us all. And I'm going to create the ultimate Dave. Now this Dave looks like shit. I don't like this what is what is this? You call yourself a Dave? You 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 dare to call yourself Dave? Pathetic. But I guess it's the best that we have. A weakling. You'll never make it in this world. But let's see what happens when we put you with Dave. Dave will sort you out. A miserable pile of Dave. leaves are pink. That's adorable. The ultimate Dave has been achieved. And now it's time to breed everything else on this island with the ultimate Dave. So that we may finally create the island of Dave that we've all been dreaming of. So this is like four generations in, so... This is uniquely distinct from all the other... shit that's on the island. Yeah, let's just go breed some shit with Dave and see what happens. Disappointment, David. Right, so let's go to our old friend, the Neon Boy, here. Let's make Neon Day. Lewis and Barbara. Perfect. Okay. Not not as neon as I was hoping, but it is growing tall. So I'm in, I'm all right with it. Oh, it's getting more neon as we go up. It's nice and red. What color are the flowers going to be? Are they going to be pink again? Or are we going to get some, like... Like, weird hybrid color? Purple! Oh, man. Now that... 
Now that, my friends, is a good ass day. Neon Dave is my man. Look at that. Look at that. That is a good goddamn day. I'm taking the flower from that, Dave. I need that Dave's flower. That's a good fucking Dave right there. Alright, so let's go back to our old friend, the dumbass flower. We haven't seen our old friend, the dumbass flower, in quite some time. Retro Wave Dave. Hell yeah. The first thing we ran into on this island, the dumbass flower. When paired with the ultimate Dave. And by the way, you better believe I'm going to breed the best two Daves that we find. Right, I doubt this is going to be anywhere near as awesome as Neon Dave. Like, how the fuck can you beat Neon Dave? Oh, it's an improvement, though. Hey, look at that. That is definitely an improvement on the dumbass flower. We we have created life, my friends, and it is so much better than the dumbass flower. It's still not great. It's still dumbass, Dave. But look at the improvement. Look how much we're improving this island. So we got neon ass tree over here, which was a different neon ass from the other neon ass. Looks dangerously sharp. It looks like it would kill you if you looked at it the wrong way. That's true. So let's try the other neon tree. Maybe we can just make two awesome neon daves. And then those two neon daves can create the ultimate Neon Dave. Which would truly be the end of all life as we know it. It's a Bendy Boy. I'll give it that. Look at that. Oh, it's got color. Oh, man. If those leaves are a good color, we got a winner right here. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's a big boy. Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, my God. Look at that. This is good shit right here. We've got two beautiful neon boys out of Dave. My God. Gorgeous. Now let me get the let me get the leaf from this guy too. Just you know. Is it pick flower? Can we? No, pick pick flower. Jesus Christ, game's a little glitchy. I'll give. It... I'll say that. Why are all the leaves origami? I don't know. <laughs> That's just one of the many secrets of Dave. So how about our old friend, the other dumbass flower? We haven't given much love to the other dumbass flower, have we? We haven't. So why not let the other dumbass flower? Oh, I forgot to name the other Dave. I forgot to name our, our good Neon Boy down here. Golden Boy Dave. There we go. Let's see what's go. Oh! Nice teal stem on this guy. What, what what secrets have you for us? It doesn't look good. It doesn't look good for the growth. It doesn't look like we're going to get much of a, a growth out. Oh, but that is nice. 
Oh, but that is nice. Look at that. Beautiful orange plumage. It's still gonna be a little tiny day, but you know, it's... It's still gonna be tiny day. But it's all right. We got one more ultimate Dave's. We got one more ultimate Dave flower to breed somewhere. And I think we got to give our love to the Bramble Boy. Because we haven't we haven't seen the Bramble Boy in a bit, have we? What's this thing? We never even saw this thing. I don't care what this thing is. So let's grab a flower from the Bramble Boy. And we're going to make Bramble Dave. make the most ultimate Dave that can be made. Don't worry you not, Sparkle Bill. That's the next step after this. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at the, oh, man, look at the plumage. Bramble Dave, you are a good-looking, you're a good-looking specimen. So we have got five flowers of different colors, actually, which I didn't, I didn't think that was going to happen. But we have a whole rainbow collection of Daves here. Dave two, Dave. -er. Yes. <laughs> True, though. So we have we have gotten a collection of five of the finest plants in the land. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do one more breeding session next to our old friend Dave. Oh, I should have used this thing, honestly. I, have... but no, I think it's better, actually, that we did it all with, like, first-run species. Okay. So I think my personal favorite of the bunch was our old friend Neon Dave. So I'm actually going to save Neon Dave for last. I'm going to breed Bramble Dave with Golden Boy Dave. And then I'm going to breed... Nope, a little farther away. Then I'm going to breed Tiny Dave with Dumbass Dave. I'm going to take the two children of those. I'm going to breed it with Neon Dave. And we're gonna see the two best Daves on the goddamn island. And I'm gonna grab another leaf from Neon Dave, actually, just just so that we can try both types of Ultimate Dave. And then we have the cure for cancer. There you go. Thank God we finally. All right, Neon Dave, I need another one of your flowers. Beautiful. Oh, I'm seeing some color down there. Ooh. Uh, that's really nice, actually. 
Bramble Dave and Go the Golden Boy Dave has golden, golden son. <laughs> and then it's kind of like fucking Rosebush Dave, I guess. That's a But that's nice. Look at, look at, look at like Golden Sun, Dave. Look at the gold trait seems to be the, uh, the fucking dominant trait in this family. Here we go. We got two more to go. We got two more to go. Right here. Get Rosebush, Dave. Golden Sun, Dave. Together. Actual flower, Dave. Let's see what we get from our old friend here. And then we're going to get two of those flowers. We're going to breed them together. See what comes out of that. And then make one final Hail Mary play to make the ultimate day. And it's a nut. Hey, look at that. It's shorter. It's shorter. I don't know if I like the fact that it's shorter. It's like a spiky... It's like anime hair, Dave. <laughs> That's... Spiky Golden Dave. Goku Dave. <laughs> That's right. I don't think the game is quite that uh, interesting, Sheepshank. Tragically, I wish it was. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to have one with Neon Dave as the pedigree. And one with Neon Dave as the second Dave. And from those two children, the flowers of those two children, we shall finally have the ultimate Dave. I was kind of hoping when I got this game that there would be animals as well, but no, apparently it's only plants. I think we've seen the width and breadth of Mendel. Uh, but you know what? I've had a good time. Oh, wow! We got the old way. We've got Dave Jr. colors growing up over here. I haven't seen plumage like this since Dave Jr. This is a goddamn Dave Jr. Jr. right here. That's a... And the, oh, wow! Interesting. Dave Double Jr. Interesting. So all the different flowers, all the different colors kind of just melded together. All right, so this is this is the final act of the stream today. We're gonna go to the highest point on the mountain. This will be the epic finale here. We're going to find Dave, the God of all life. Uh, chat pick regular junior junior or double junior for the. Who do you think should be the first one selected? Keeping in mind that the second one is... I think the second one's the... They haven't really made that clear, but I think the second one is the one that passes more genes along. Okay, so make Dave Jr. Jr. the dominant. Keep the orange. Yeah. Alright. The ultimate... The ultimate plant... Of life... Of love... This is our boy right here. This is our boy right here. Sadly, it looks like it's going to be a little bit of a shrimpy boy. But it's growing. It's growing. The pinnacle of Dave. The final Dave. Okay, yeah, it grew up it grew up big and strong. It grew up big and strong. Excellent. 
and bright green and orange leaves. Dave. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that majesty. Dave, son of Dave. King of all, king of our world. He who keeps the world going. Beautiful. I cry every time. I don't know about y'all. <laughs> 